All right, y'all, I gotta read God's word, okay? I keep forgetting. And now another coyote again from far. They must live right there or something. But he's actually walking away. Yeah, he, he was right here and he heard me. I'll leave him some food for sure, you know what I'm saying? I'll leave him a sandwich. Hopefully he gets to him. I wish he could understand. Don't go so fucking far, you know? He knows me. He came out again. No, actually, like I said, he was probably right here. I didn't see him, but he hears when you come up. You know, they have a very keen sense of hearing, so. All right, so we have, um, just gotta make sure, because that's not two of them, you know? There might be some, somebody has to stay back with the pups, you know what I mean? So, um, um I'm sure the coyotes travel far until they can find food, man. They, they be, they be, they be around. Around Psalm 11. In the Lord I take refuge. How then can you say to me, flee like a bird to your mountain? For look, the wicked bend their bows as they set their arrow against the strings to shoot from the shadows at the upright in heart. When the foundations are being destroyed, what can the righteous do? The Lord is in his holy temple. The Lord is on his heavenly throne. He observes everyone on earth. His eyes examine them. The Lord examines the righteous, but the wicked, those who love violence, he hates with the passion. On the wicked, he will rain fiery coals and burning sulfur. A scorching wind will be their lot. For the Lord is righteous. He loves justice. The upright will see his face. It, like where that pricks me is like my my um my my guard is so up because like you know being hurt as a kid you know I do have anger but not to the point I can't control it like I'm smart enough to avoid situations I don't urge for it like those serial like I don't want to get like this because when I'm reading the Lord's word but you know like those serial killers and stuff there'll be guys that go to work and stuff some of them are pretty off too because it'd be the drugs that throws them off you know but I mean I said to myself like. A, I don't know how my if, if I if I trust you and I see like I don't know I don't know I ha have a I, I I really do have a guard up you know and I don't like it you know I once had a friend named Angel I met him Angel shout out Angel um, my friend Andrew's cousin and um, I hope all's well with him and his family as I always wish everybody I don't wish nobody harm but but I remember like because he's he noticed like how I, I can't really be in big groups with people and stuff like that and I get anxious. He like looked at me one time and he said this as if not only he was talking to me, but he was talking to himself as if he recognized this feeling. And he says, uh, man, I, I know I, 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 like, like, I remember that when, when I, like that thing on your, your chest, like you, you, you're suffocating, or like, like that heaviness on your chest. But like he said it because like if I have my guard up, he's the other person has their guard up because they're like, this person's kind of on edge or whatever the case might be. And that happens from things that childhood, you know, you have your guard up and things like that. And it's hard to like feel comfortable around you know? around um certain types of individuals that maybe you know kind of remind you of certain things in the past, you know. And um and sometimes it's like it stems from the tra childhood trauma, you know. And we do our best to try to create a life around that, you know. And then we kinda do stuff that's may not the best for us, but I don't know, this world offers some sort of return by doing that, which for me is music, you know? But sometimes it feels like a trap because uh, you're kind of saying your emotions, like it's like you're having a diary, you know? So that's what, with that violent part, like it pricks me in that way, but no way will I let my, should you let your mind, you know, these are just human natural feelings that we feel, you know? You know don't succumb, you know? Don't be a violent individual, you know? Drugs, alcohol, you know, those things kind of get us, our anger to the best of us. Violent in words, violent in actions, you know. You know, it's, it's not about violence, you know. But I don't know, I don't know. That, so that part kind of pricks me a little bit. Like I don't want evil. I'm not an evil person. I, I don't you know. But harbor deception in the heart. Every lies everyone lies to their neighbor. They flatter with their lips. Or actually that was this is number twelve. Okay, Psalm 12, help Lord, for no one is faithful anymore. Those who are loyal have vanished from the human race. Everyone lies to their neighbor. They flatter with their lips, but harbor deception in their hearts. Or let me name one, stop. 